Trace Lab provides an experimental environment in which researchers in both industry and academia can design and execute traceability experiments. For purposes of this short demo, I'm going to show you a very simple experiment in which we use the vector space model to generate traceability links between a set of source and target artifacts. As you see, the experimental workflow is shown here on the canvas. It is designed as a workflow, but set up as a precedence graph. Each of the components is defined in terms of inputs, outputs, and configuration parameters. We're going to look at the tracer component. You can see that it has inputs of source and target artifacts and dictionary index. And it outputs similarity matrix as a result of the component's computation. Also, some configuration parameters have been set up, and some general information about the component is available. So now I'm going to go ahead and run the experiment. Components exchange information through the workspace that is shown on the left-hand side of the screen. You can see that as the experiment runs, that the various data structures and data is output to the workspace view. For example, the source and target artifacts, as well as the similarity matrix that was output by the tracer component. So now I'm going to add a results chart into my experiment. Adding a UI to an experiment is as easy as dragging and dropping it into the graph and then reconnecting the precedence links. Now if I rerun the experiment, I can actually see the results visualized on the screen. Tracelab supports the concept of benchmarks. A benchmark is a way of comparing and contrasting a new experiment against a set of previously recorded results. The metrics compared can range from execution speed and accuracy to visual representations of the data. I'm going to load an experiment that I want to run against a benchmark. To do this, I open the benchmark wizard. Then I select the benchmark that I want to use. I make sure that all of the data mappings are correct. When we begin processing, the previously highlighted experiment will be inserted into the benchmark at this location. The Tracelab benchmark feature is built around the idea of a contest. Each contest focuses on a specific task, such as automatically retrieving traces from requirements to code, or designing an effective GUI for visualizing trace results. Researchers are encouraged to compare their results against the benchmarks for validation and relative ranking purposes. Tracelab also provides support for composite components. At the moment, you see two different styles of components, primitive ones with the rounded edges and composite components with the sharper edges. Looking inside one of the composite components will allow you to see the components that make up the composite. More complex experiments are also possible by means of logic control components. Logic control components make it possible to select specific execution paths at runtime based on data from the workspace. For more information, please visit our coes.org website. Thank you.